my lovely, lovely Tauruses out there. So let's get to it. This is your tarot and astrology reading with your girl, Madam X, on Frequency Vo Radio for March. So let's just talk about the astrology a little bit because I don't want to make these videos too long. So uh, the Sun, Mercury, Venus, and Neptune are in Pisces. So a stellium going on in Pisces, a lot going on. For you, Taurus, Taurus rising, that's going to fall in your 11th house. So that's going to be um, in your area of your friendships, relationships, social social, social circles, <laughs> and things of that nature. So you may um, notice a lot of changes going on there. And it may tie into your personal relationships because it is going to be opposing the 7th house. And we're going to, your 7th house, which is Virgo, and we're going to, um, I'm sorry, your 5th house. The fifth house of Virgo, which uh, we're going to have a full moon on Friday. So you may be um, having some information, some things come to light about people you're affiliated with, people you're in partnerships with, people you deal with, people who are in your social circles um, on a day-to-day basis or on, you know, on a regular basis. You may be... Um, having some realizations and some things coming to light you may be you could possibly during this time be um get having romantic feelings for people that are friends or really um you know realizing uh how you feel towards certain groups and things you're affiliated with and people that you have in your life so off the bat, Taurus, uh, with your reading, I see that you are trying to fight some karmic cycles and some karmic things from the past. There is something that didn't work out. There's something that didn't come through. There's a task that you feel that you did not complete or um, maybe something that got the best of you and it has to do with your past and possibly something you walked away from. But whatever you walked away from, I see that you didn't walk away alone, but you walked away to uh, what's possibly a new start. But it's looking like, or you want a new start because you're trying to get away from whatever this karmic thing is in your past. You're really trying to get some uh, balance towards. But what's really important, and, and when I say balance, it's funny because these readings, you know, they come as... I record them. Nothing is pre-thought out, but balance is so appropriate. Um, a key word. You may really want to concentrate and meditate on balance because the cards, you got the, these cards twice. I used the Witch's Tarot and uh, for your cards, I laid nine cards and then I clarified with the Rider Weight and I used about six cards to clarify. I clarify the two of swords in reverse with the two of swords. So the right, you had the two of swords in reverse. The clarifier was the two of swords upright. So you're really trying to get some balance. You're going back and forth and back and forth. There's some thought, there's some something that you cannot get on your mind. It is nagging, it is gnawing at you about a decision or something that you have to had to walk away from that you feel was possibly unfair or unbalanced or something of that nature. And with this new start a new discovery or this new energy you may have a new spark to really make some movement and change some things and maybe um you may have been getting some arguments in your partnership lately some tourists may have even um be coming out of relationships you may um uh be breaking up possible divorces with some tourists possible some divorces with some, with some Tauruses, but leaving some relationships, maybe somebody hasn't been there for you in a health issue or something, Taurus. I don't know. Maybe you just been feeling an imbalance and maybe this imbalance just isn't in this love relationship. Maybe you have really been feeling a physical imbalance and you're just trying to get back on your feet. Maybe you've had some kind of surgery that didn't go well. Maybe you've had some kind of accident. Maybe you've been arguing with some people. Maybe um, something's going on with uh, 
communication, like you've had some bad communication, some arguments in a partnership. Maybe um, this had to do with online, maybe some negative communications online, even possible spying or things of that nature, withholding information. And maybe now you're going to finally communicate certain things because you want it. You have to get some balance. You have to settle whatever this karmic situation, whatever this is from the past, whatever that you're dealing with right now that's interrupting your work. Um, Tortures, you could have been out of work because of not feeling well, because of what was ever going on, whatever you had to take a break um, for, whatever this imbalance is stemming from, you could have, it could have affected your work. It could have affected your job. It's definitely affected your relationship. You may... You may be having some issues with thinking about more than one person. Maybe uh, another person coming in between a partnership. Maybe not being able to balance some sort of situation like that. And then something comes out into the open. Someone makes themselves known as a third party or something like that. Or maybe someone makes their their feelings really known. The, you also have fours. Fours is a big thing too because you got the four of swords in reverse in the reading with the uh, witch's tarot deck. But then you had the page in reverse with the witch's tarot. And the clarifier for the page in reverse is also the four in reverse. So, Taurus, is maybe you feel like you're doing too much and you want to give up. You want to give up on something. But I feel like there are more people involved than just you and your partner. There could have been some sort of Libra, Gemini, Aquarius that came in between a partnership. And it just really threw whatever's going on off balance. It threw you off balance. It threw you for a loop. It's kind of got you overreacting, going crazy, maybe arguing with people or something like that because of this imbalance. You del And I keep saying imbalance. And it's, it's a thing here with the chemistry. There's something off with the chemistry in the relationship. Maybe you're getting to know somebody that you thought you knew, but you really did not know all the way. And you're realizing maybe there's a certain aspect of your of love, of this relationship that is missing. Maybe there's something deep inside of you that you're fighting towards. Is what I'm seeing here. Because you really want the passion and the love. But I'm seeing that's not there. It, it's not there. It's not there. And there could be some sort of sexual issues going on here because I, there are a lot of swords, a lot of staffs, swords and staffs. So air and fire energy. So you're dealing with Tauruses. You could be dealing with Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, or you could be dealing with Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. That could be some moon arising, Venus, or um, any other place in the chart where uh, the energy is strong. But I'm feeling Taurus themselves have, 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 are feeling um, like they didn't finish something, didn't complete something, something didn't go right. They did not accomplish a task or they did not do something uh, uh, right. And they're fighting whatever this is that happened in the past or they're fighting whatever this karmic situation is. But there is a lot here that gives me a very, very strong swords energies and staff energy so either there's been some fighting internally or you really have been fighting with people physically or there's been some backstabbing i'm really getting that i'm getting because the some swords are upright some swords are down so some backstabbing maybe there's some sex or something going on with sex maybe a lot of sex maybe a lack of sex or passion Maybe too much sex. Maybe fertility issues. I don't know. Getting to know something about some somebody. And it has a lot to do with communication and action. S sex. Wanting new beginnings. Wanting to be fertile. Wanting to make something happen. Wanting to balance something out. Wanting a complete new start where you went wrong. You want to kind of change your actions around. You want to get off your ass 
Taurus and do something. You want to do something about something that's going on. This just got you all out of whack and all out of balance. And, you know, for other Tauruses that may be going through something else, um, maybe you just need to get to know your partner a little bit better. Try to find a chemistry in that relationship. Maybe there's somebody that you want to be with that you have chemistry chemistry with and you really feel like you deserve that relationship and you want to get to know that person better. And if that's the case, then do that. But for the other Tauruses and the things that um, I talked about, you know, you want to really kind of deal with whatever this is that's going on and get yourself balanced out, get back to fairness, whatever's going on in the relationship. This got you fighting, fighting. 